Can't believe that fucking rule. Scratching up the equipment. Here we are. It's uh, Thursday. Too bad it's not Friday. Good idea. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see if our great microphone works. Boy, it's just gorgeous out here today. Who wouldn't want to be driving one of those 2900s today where you can't open the windows? This is too nice out here. It's beautiful. It's one of those days where you're just glad to be alive. Too bad it's not going to last. Graced by the presence of Operator Chuck today. Hallelujah. <laughs> and Hallelujah. he's got his combat hat ready. How are you doing, buddy boy? Not right. I'll take it. Figured you like that. Really? Sad of the day, OS degree, OSU degrees online fits into your life. E campus. All right. Okay. 854 on Thursday. Great day. Nice and cool. Beautiful. Feel good. The first time I felt really good in a while. Yesterday was starting to feel better, but today I actually feel good. Uh, nice day to be driving a bus. 
Nice day to be driving a 1700 bus. Uh, hopefully the weather report's going to be wrong because they're talking about triple digits next week. Could be a problem. Got some oral surgery I have to deal with here again. I thought I had that situation fixed, but I didn't, so I got to go back. So I'm not sure if I'll be able to come in during those triple digits or not. We'll see how I feel. Um, anyway, I hope uh, people caught the uh, director, one of the directors, Lynn name is actually stood up for the TriMet benefits package and we want to congratulate him for knowing the way that it's supposed to be. I don't know how how this culture has ever allowed itself to be drawn into this idea that if your employer gives you good benefits that's somehow bad, that's somehow cheating. I don't get it. How did this happen? How did this happen? They can spend trillions to bail out the banks they can spend billions to wage a war, but for some reason there's a problem with providing citizens such as uh, TriMet employees decent jobs, providing a public service to the to people. I mean, we hear these right wingers saying nobody transit is irrelevant. Well, they're not riding on the buses and the trains. There's thousands and thousands of people that use this service. So, I'm not sure how the culture ever got so screwed up with this. Anyway, that's it for today. Nothing, nothing of major consequence. Seems like the whole controversy has kind of died down. The drivers seem to be a little bit more mellow now. I mean, every time these news things come out, it just it just makes us crazy. And can you, I can't blame us. I mean, they're picking on us constantly. We're mean. We're rude. We're awful. We're we're this. Take away our benefits. We're just, you know, it, it's just a constant stream of negative stuff that they hit us with. And uh, I know that's the culture again. You know, the culture hates buses and bus drivers. I was just talking to Ron, one of the extra board drivers here, and he, he swore that the same lady on the route he's driving over uh, where he uh, turns left on Cornell from 185th, gets right up next to him, right up next to him, and won't let him in, won't speed up or slow down, and won't let him in so he can merge over to the left. And he's seen this person before. It's almost like that person is targeting bus drivers, and we know that it's happening. It's happening out here. It's crazy. You know, I really That's tried to light. use this microphone today because I know they want me to That's use it. But every time I try to use, go over to go, to I try to go, uh, 150, it doesn't work. I'm like, 150, and then I have to look stupid and go, 158! You know, because it doesn't work. It like works. It works when it wants to work. Yeah, I hate that. So, I'm not using those things until you make them work right. I'm, I'll yell. I got a loud voice. Okay, I'm in compliance with the uh, SOP. But that these things don't work. They only work when they want to work. Seven thirty. Here, somebody turned in this black backpack. In this one. It's all. It was here. Take this backpack it's, and give it to Lost and Found. This is how he turned it in. Like this, all. Crumpled up. You know what? They stole out of it before they gave it to you. That's why it's just like that. Yeah. <laughs> somebody, somebody went through it, but.